Neuromodulation for epilepsy involves implanting devices either into the brain or on the vagus nerve of the neck. Unlike traditional surgeries for epilepsy, which involve removing brain tissue that causes seizures, neuromodulation allows us to implant devices in the brain that stimulate and reduce the likelihood of seizures starting and spreading. In many cases, these types of surgeries can have less of an impact on functions such as memory, attention, or language, for example. Neuromodulation allows patients to reduce their seizures and in rare cases can have the effect of making patients seizure-free. The three types of neuromodulation for epilepsy are vagus nerve stimulation, or VNS, responsive neurostimulation, RNS, and deep brain stimulation, or DBS. A deep brain stimulator, or DBS, has two main components. The first are thin wires that are about the width of a dull pencil tip. These are inserted into a central brain area called the thalamus. The DBS wires are connected to a pulse generator, or battery, which sits below the collarbone. The DBS electrodes deliver a scheduled, regular pattern of stimulation to the thalamus. Over time, this stimulation has a neuromodulatory effect, which reduces the likelihood that the brain gives off and spreads seizure activity. The advantage of DBS is you do not necessarily need to know exactly the point where the seizure starts. The stimulation, meaning the electrical pulse, is on regardless of whether you're having a seizure or not. The great thing about deep brain stimulation is that not only do you see immediate benefit, you see benefit over months, and our studies have also shown that you see benefit over several years. It is a journey and we are there to help you maximize the benefit from a neuromodulation device.